as we begin looking at factoring out greatest common factors. An important thing to note is that that greatest common factor can be a binomial. A greatest common factor is just anything that's in common that is multiplied by each term. So if we have the example 5x times 2y minus 7 plus 6y times 2y minus 7, you notice that both of these two terms have this binomial in common. In fact, I'm going to highlight it. They both have 2y minus 7 in common. Because that's a common factor, we can pull it out front. Now, as it's in parentheses there, so we'll pull it out front in parentheses, dividing both by 2y minus 7 in parentheses, the GCF. And when we divide that out, what's left, the 5x plus 6y, is going to make up the other factor. We have now factored out the binomial GCF. Similarly, in example 2, we see 3x times 2x plus 1 minus 7 times 2x plus 1. Again, we see a binomial common factor. They both have this 2x plus 1 in parentheses. So we'll pull that out, and what's left, the 3x minus 7, is going to make up the next factor. So when factoring out a GCF, we pull it out front. What's left goes in parentheses, and that GCF we pull out front can be a binomial as long as we keep it in the parentheses.